Hi, Mark Cabano, it's Chris here, and tonight I'm at this Pecha Kucha speech night where I've been asked to give a talk about my experience with language and food here in the Philippines as part of the Buang Nalika celebrations that are going all this month. So I'm pretty nervous. It's this format where you've got like 20 seconds and 20 slides, or sorry, 20 slides, and each one is for 20 seconds. And you like, they just keep flipping. So if you don't finish that point, you you just gotta, it's just gonna keep going, and then your, your presentation finished, everyone's gonna clap whether you're finished or not. You're done. So it's like really time boxed. A little nervous, did very little preparation. Thanks to the team for making the slide deck for me, which I'm going to talk to and practice. So let's see how I go. All right, check it out. So, good morning, Mr. Chris Urbano, Rayuhan, uh, negosyo at uh, YouTuber dito sa Pilipinas. Tagalutod niya ako actually kasi yung show ko tungkol sa, sa cooking talaga. Now my journey, I'm going to share with you tonight about uh, embracing Filipino uh, language and culture. Pero uh, we can English ang ginagamit ko um, ilang mga konyo uh, sa audience na ito. Eh. Yung concern ko talaga na they might not understand me kung kaya ang ginagamit ko. <laughs> I actually uh, attended university, go classes, I think Bahasa Indonesia, you know, I studied the language for about seven years. So uh, what I found in my time in Indonesia was that language was truly a way to bridge the cultural divides with people. Like you could go to Indonesia uh, and be a student there at an English speaking school um, and you would never learn anything about the place. It's language that allows you to really see into a culture and see into people's uh, hearts and minds and, and what they value. The reason I came here was because of a girl. I uh, ended up coming here and thought, you know, I like this person, I want to see where this goes. And I'm a guy who, because of my time in Indonesia, if I'm going to be in a relationship, I want to be able to speak the language of my, my wife and, and her family. And where I found the best place to learn Filipino was not here in Makati or in BGC or the Conyos or the university students and professionals. It was actually in the Palenque, uh, with all the uh, <laughs> Matanda, Are, Lutsa, Lisa, Mindera, Tapos, you know, you make Tawa, that was for the country. You make Tawa. I really just believe in uh, getting to know people. The power of language will allow us to get to know. Whatever country we're in, the power of language will allow us to get to know people and read really know people. That's what really is exciting me about language. So keep in touch. Feel free to get in touch with me if any answers tonight interests you and thank you for having me at the presentation and allowing me to share my story with you tonight. Allow Salamat sa inyong lahat. Wow, so I just got a, uh, out of it. I had a chat to a few people. They were like, oh yeah, you know, you did really well. But people always say that, so I'll let you guys be the judge. Leave a comment if you think I nailed it or didn't nail it. Uh, yeah, it's, it's really hard. The slides just keep on flipping through and you're like, oh crap, <laughs> crap. <laughs> like it's like faster than you can make your point, whatever. But it's kind of cool because I think it really teaches you the art of brevity and like you know you've got to be really concise. You know, I don't see that just say the sentence. The lang walang qualifier, walang dag dag, walang you know that thing where you kind of say it in English and you say it in Tagalog or say it in Tagalog and then say it in English for emphasis. You can't do that with this format. So. Yeah, super bilious. Let me know what you guys thought of what I actually said, and then, I don't know if you know all that stuff about me, but now you do. Hope you enjoy being a part of this moment with me tonight, and uh, yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel. I asked everyone in there, I was like, shameless. I'm like, guys, I have a book coming out. Guys, I have a YouTube channel, subscribe to it. <laughs> so you can do the same. Um, like, subscribe, and check it out on Facebook. Bye now.